What's up, guys? Chef Anthony here at the Robinson Experience Center. So excited. Cauliflower's on my mind. And you know, we're doing steaks. So we're gonna grill some big cauliflower steaks. I got this great head of cauliflower. Let's jump right into this jam. All right, what you wanna do is, if you got any of the cabbage, like the leaves on the back, what you wanna do is just get your um, pointed end of the knife, and we just wanna actually just trim it around. Like, get this out. Be very careful because we're gonna cut these thick steaks. We don't wanna dig too much into the flesh part. So see how we're just doing it like this? Just taking these little leafy green pieces right off, okay? Now, the best part is, because the cauliflower will crumble, things like that, we wanna take our knife, just go right down the center, okay? Perfect like this. Look at that. Boom, that's all we have to do. No, no, just kidding. So now, we're gonna actually take it one more side, probably about two inches. So these are like thick cut steaks, right? Nice and easy like that. Boom, look at that. That's our perfect guy right there, okay? Next, we're gonna do the same thing on the other side. Check that out. Perfect. You want your tomahawk steak, you can have it cauliflower style, okay different ways to do this, guys. You can go any different route. We're going the Italian route, it being me, so we're gonna actually get some garlic together along with, I got some white vinegar, I got two tablespoons of uh, white balsamic, three tablespoons of olive oil, and I'm just gonna mix a teaspoon of garlic right in there. Okay, kinda like give it like our marinade, all right? Now I have um, just some Italian seasoning, probably quarter, uh, half teaspoon, something like that, and then I got quarter teaspoon of like some Montreal steak just to give it that steak feel. We're gonna pop just a hair of that in here, all right? And what we wanna do is, the cauliflower has moisture, so we don't wanna like soak this. So we just wanna dress it so we get some flavor coming off the grill, okay? Just wanna go like that, kinda get in between, but make sure we get the surface area, crew. That's what you wanna see. We wanna get that great color and caramelization on this that you're gonna see. So look how nice that is. We're gonna do this guy as well, all right? Perfect. Don't forget, flip it, just like that. Now smear it all together. This, guys, we're gonna take it right to our cookie sheet. Get it going. This, guys, is gonna head to our grill. Probably three to five minutes on each side just to get caramelized, get tender, get fully cooked, okay? Let's head to the grill. All right, guys, grill's blazing hot. We got our seasoned cauliflower steaks here. We're gonna put them on the grill right here. Nice, just flat on the center like that. And now we just wanna get that great char. Here's our extra pieces. We can put those on later. We're looking for uniformity. It's gonna be about two to three minutes on each side. Get that nice char, okay? All right, gang, been about two minutes. We're just gonna give it a nice half turn right here. So we'll just pick it up, give it a nice half turn so we can work on getting those good grill marks, okay? Just like that. All right, guys, been about three minutes. We're gonna give it a nice flip. Look at that, great little char, a little caramelization on that. Fire this guy down. It's gonna be another three minutes on this side, so it's nice and tender and golden. I love it. All right, crew, we're gonna give it another half turn here. And this will be the last one we do before we're ready to eat this amazing cauliflower. Looking great. All right, crew, all finished, ready to take this off. Let's look at these beautiful steaks. Look at that caramelization. That's great. Put that down right here. Oh, another one. Beautiful cauliflower steaks. Nice and tender, right to the core. A little bit of moisture in there, but look at the, look at the smoke coming off this. Oh, I'm gonna enjoy these. All right, guys, grilled cauliflower steaks finished. That's a wrap.